boys and girls. My name is Wendy Lewis, and I'm going to share with you what I do for a living at this time. I am the clinic director here at Fastest Labs in Greensboro, and I'm going to let my photographer show you some of our signs in the lobby. We do employer drug screening, and we can test individuals as well. We also do DNA testing. But as you are probably aware, when you go to get a job, you have to have the skills for that job. But nowadays, a lot of employers also wanna know that they have a safe, uh, drug-free work environment for their customers and for their workers. And so they call on us to perform those drug screens. So they come in to see us, and I'm gonna show you around the lab so you can sort of see a little bit of what we do. So we'll come straight back here to the lab and I will show you. So there are several ways that we can do a drug test. We are looking for things, of course, that um, can show up in a urine drug test. And I'm gonna show you in order to collect someone's urine and test it, um, we use a cup like this and they We'll collect their urine in the cup, bring it out. We will put the lid on it. And then we actually have a new device that will scan our drug screens. We just set them in the stand like this. And then we just have to push a couple of buttons and it will read it and tell us if there's anything there or not, which most people of course do not have anything they shouldn't have in their system. And so that's how the urine drug test works. We can also collect saliva and test that. We don't do that many of those, but that is another way. And it's just, you put a little um, spongy thing in the cheek and you just collect saliva and test that. One of the other things we do a lot of our hair tests. So we have a little pouch that has a little tray in it that we make a little tray for the hair. And in order to collect the hair, we take it from the crown area behind um, in the thicker part of where the hair grows. We cut close to the root. We use a clip to keep the hair out of the way that we don't want to cut. And then we use the scissors to snip the hair off. We lay it in the tray and then whoop, we fold it up and slide it in the packaging and send it to the lab to be tested. And then there's all kinds of little seals we have to put on to make sure that um, everything is done correctly. We also can collect toenails and fingernails and we just have our nail clippers, normal nail clippers, and we collect those in the same little silver tray and we can send those off to be tested as well. And so that's basically about how we do the tests and that kind of thing. I will take you through to the office and let you see where we do some of our other tasks. So of course we have a phone that we use all the time to take phone calls from companies that need our services. We also have a computer. We do lots of work on the computer. Um, we service individuals as well and we have to have all of these tools in order to communicate well with our companies and the individuals. And one of the things that I do want to mention is you do need to have good people skills in this line of work because people, when they call in, they want to know that you understand their need and that you're, um, you want to do the best service for them that you can do. And so you want to be able to communicate well with them. Um, some college is helpful. I do have a college degree and I taught school for a very long time. And that is how I know Mrs. Pegram. And so it's always helpful the more education you have for any kind of work like this in an office. It gives you a good background and would help you with the task that you have to do. I do want to mention that one of the things that I probably do not like about my job is a lot of the paperwork, but if I get that out of the way, I do those things first so I can enjoy the rest of the things I do. But I really love helping people when they have a need. Um, one of the things we didn't mention is that we collect DNA um, samples from people and help them sometimes connect with people they didn't even know were related to them. 
And that's one of my favorite things about my job. And we just use a long uh, Q-tip. I meant to have one of those up here, but we just swab the inside of the cheek and we package it. There's a lot of paperwork that has to be done correctly for that part of my job too. But um, anyway, that's sort of what I do. And I think this is great. Miss Pebram is asking us to send these videos in to her so you all can learn more about our job. And I hope that um, you have enjoyed learning a little bit about what I do. I hope you have a great rest of your day. Bye-bye.